eerie dark outside. You can't tell it on camera. Fear under flood warnings and thunderstorm warnings that could possibly turn into tornadoes because we're supposed to get up to 60 mile per hour winds. Do you see it? It just, oh, do you see it? It, it like the, in the middle, yes. it like just kind of, it just snapped. And look at that one leaning though. So we had a tree fall. Do what's right for us. Started out here, way beyond the tracks. The story of us and how we never look back. Cause this is our time, this is our life. And sometimes all you need is to smile. To get by. Good morning, everyone. It yes, this is Dog Academy right here. Yep, puppies everywhere. Puppies. Bradley's holding Charlotte because Charlotte wants to do school today with her. Charlotte needs her bangs cut. Yeah. Holy cow, she's like a little sheep dog. You know those little sheep dogs where their hair's like over their eyes, but they can see. Yeah. That's exactly what she looks like. Watch. Charlotte, you guys cannot even see her eyeballs. It is sad. Somebody needs a haircut. I'll cut them today. What? You what? I want to hold her. You want to hold her. We are getting school done right now. Kayla is going to work. She had to work today from, I think she's working until six tonight. And I had to change some bulbs. And I absolutely despise yellow bulbs like the soft white i don't like them do you guys see how bad this looks like i hate it but this bulb i decided to take out and put over here this is my favorite a lot of people don't like the whole bright daylight look i love it i think it's clean it makes the videos look better i just don't like that but i'm out of bulbs this one is actually one that's just like this but because of the shade it just looks different i don't like the yellowish tint. What, babe? Oh, she likes to hide under chairs. She's still under there. Oh, <laughs> that's where I sit on the corner of this to do computer stuff, and then I'm back and forth between that chair and this chair, that chair, this chair. And how do you like our baby gates? This one's normal. This is our new one that we just bought. That was the first just kidding. Chair mat that I had ever gotten. That is the first and cheer mat. I got that. I didn't get that for actual chair that I got because I was at the. Start, I did gymnastics. You did. And I had like a, you do. I had like one of you those did. bars. I had like one of those bars in my room. Mm -hmm. and did, yes, yeah. that's why we bought it. Yeah. So the bottom of it had like a black bar and mom didn't like it like that because she was like, like what if you like flip over and like your foot lands wrong and you land on that bar? She's like, it's gonna hurt. And I was yeah. like, well, what do you want me to do? So we ended up going and we got a mat and then we put that underneath it so then when I'm flipping stuff, I have something underneath me to catch me in case I fall. Yeah, and we've kept it and now you've got a ginormous mat. Uh, yeah, now I have a big one. And it's then, huge. And now I have a blow up she one. Really yes. Now I have more. She will, ones. the problem is the weather it's is just crappy. Right it's I'll, cold, I'll, it's wet. When it starts getting used Our to me, ground. when it starts getting warmer, I always bring it outside and I go outside and I just like Well, we were going to take it out last night, or not last night, yesterday. but yesterday, but your dad's like, because of all the rain, the ground is so muddy. Then you wouldn't want to fold it up muddy. Yeah. That it's big one? You can. We've put it in here before. Tomorrow, it's supposed to be 60 degrees. Like, I don't think it's going to stick. Really? Unfortunately. It's gonna, but it says all week it's supposed to be in the 60s. Yeah, Except well, Friday, your dad says it's cold. supposed to get back cold again. I'm like, it's I'm ready for warm weather. Friday, but Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday is supposed to be in the um, 60s. I think on Wednesday it's supposed to be like 68. That would be nice. I, know, wouldn't it? I don't know if you guys feel the same as me, but I personally feel like winter has been here forever. Riley's ever going. It just feels like it has dragged on for six you months. You know what I mean? If you think about it, it's only been cold since like December. Because it was warm in November, remember? What, what's going on? I mean, I'm not rushing. Well, no, but life, don't you remember? But it was like, it was really warm all the way up to November. And that's because me, because you remember me and Kevin were like, oh, I'm ready for it to get cold. Yeah. And then it got cold in like December and we were like, never mind. Go oh, back. I know. Please leave. I mean, I understand we have to have winter. Not everybody does, though. Fortunate for people. I wish we did. <laughs> we're just not cold, cold natured people. I I'd just, rather be hot than cold. 
I think I had to. I'd much rather be hot. Cause there's, you can find ways to cool off and when it's cold, you just don't want to do nothing. When it's beautiful, bright, sunny, warm outside, you just feel like, you just feel so much more motivated. I feel motivated to get up and like clean house, which I know probably be like, clean the house, you know, but that's me. I'm motivated to organize. I'm motivated to get outside. I'm motivated to go on walks. I'm motivated to just go in the backyard, enjoy the sunshine. Ugh, nobody, I mean, there are probably some people out there that love it when it's cold. If you're one of those people, let me know down below. If you're not, let me know as well. What are you? Do you like cold weather? Do you like hot weather? We're not even going in between. In between would be perfect, but what do you guys think? I just hate it because you can't get outside and really just enjoy anything, and that's how I feel. I feel like we've been so homebound lately because it's just been so rainy and ugly. We haven't had a chance to even just go walking. You know, and I enjoy that. I like getting out of the house, and we can't even do that. So we're sitting here doing school, and all of a sudden it got really eerie dark outside. You can't tell it on camera. You never can. Never, never, never. But in person, it's really dark. Anyway, it starts raining. And then what do you hear, Bri? Thunder. And Briley goes looks on the internet to check. And what does it say? We're under flood warnings and thunderstorm warnings that could possibly turn into tornadoes because we're supposed to get up to 60 mile per hour winds. And the wind is starting to blow. I don't know if you guys can see our lights outside we're not under, moving. Like, we're not under right now. We're not under a tornado watch, which is good. Because usually the watch comes first and then the warning comes after that. We're right. not under any type of tornado, anything. But they said that it could, it turn could into, possibly turn into like something with a tornado. Be just because we're supposed to get like lightning, thunder, downpours. And it's supposed to be really, really powerful winds. Let's hope it doesn't. That it could possibly turn into it. The good thing that we have going for us is that it's like not hot. Mm hmm true. It's cold, but I mean still it's been the middle of December we've gotten tornado warnings before. So. Yeah, um, and it's so crazy though, like our weather's so wacky. I have decided to start taking everything out of the pantry because, um, can we just say hot mess? Oh my gosh. The top shelf looks the best, but like this is bothering me. This is really bothering me and kind of this bothering me. It's all bothering me. So we're going to go ahead and start organizing. And you guys look at this. This is just like Valentine's candy. Like what? And I want to go around and take down Valentine's stuff because that's something I haven't done yet. I just have not made time for it. But yeah, that's what's going on. Just want to give you guys an update. And we'll keep a check on the weather. I need to take this, move this thing. We put the puppies up for a little bit. Because they get restless being out. They love being in their crates, which sounds kind of crazy. But I don't know. They won't sleep outside their crates. So when they take their naps, they like to be in the crates. But And I was just sitting here thinking about something. While it's on my mind, I thought I'd mention it. Um, I really, really want um, turf grass in the backyard. I really do. The more I think about it, the more benefit I see from it um, for many factors. Not only because Aiden has like really severe allergies to any kind of grass and he has a hard time going outside playing because if he even touches the grass, touches his face or just breathing it in, running through it, he will get headaches and get sick. And you know, we've been dealing with that for a long time and our backyard is not so overly huge. I don't think it would cost a fortune to do it. So I'm really gonna look into some companies that possibly might would do that. I don't even know who does it around here, like residential wise. I know a lot of businesses will get it done. Of course, like um, soccer fields, things like that. But I want turf grass really bad in the backyard. Wouldn't you guys like it? That tree over there, do you see it? It just fell, do you see it? It fell? Do you see it? It's like leaning. <gasps> this one right here? Yeah. The small, the little one? Like the little thin one, do you see it leaning over? Do you see it? Did that just happen? Mm -hmm. I just saw it. Do you see it? Yeah, I right do there? see it. How's oh wait, funny? which one? The one back there. You see the one that's like bent, like that. It like the in the middle. Yeah. Like, it just snapped. And it's look like at leaning. that one leaning though. Where? No, like look over here. Like okay, you see where the pole is on the <laughs> fence? Yeah. It's so hard to show people things yes. sometimes. Look straight up, and you see that one is leaning. Yeah. That oh. one. See it? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. I just so, saw that one back there. It just started leaning. Really, really badly. So we had a tree fall, but it's small. Yeah. Small. Oh, listen. Do you hear that? I don't know if you guys can hear it, but the wind's really picking up. 
Oh my gosh, what about trampoline moves? I need that. I know, and with it having the net on it, it <laughs> makes it more able to be picked up. Anyway, we'll keep you posted on the weather as the day goes on. Hopefully nothing bad happens. Um, and we don't get any really bad weather, but back to what I was saying, turf grass, if you have any, let me know. Do you love it, do you hate it? Um, there's no maintenance, so I don't see why you would hate it. I just don't know, I think it'd be a great thing to get. So let me know if you have any, what, you, what your thoughts are on it. How expensive is it? I need to get somebody out here to price our backyard because like I said, it's not huge because we have most of it fenced in. Um, but I'd love to know, I want to get it done. So yeah. Look who's home. Kayla. For like five minutes. Heating you up some rice, I see. Yeah. Yes? Why do you seem so down? I just hate this weather. I hate rain too, I know. It's cold. I can't run my fingertips are. Have you been outside? I don't blame you. So, Kayla, we'll be off in a few hours. You only have a few hours left, so that'll be good, right? Yeah. Aiden's reading the story of Christopher Robin, yeah. Winnie yeah. the Pooh, and I think we should watch that movie, the new one, because we haven't seen right it. Right now. Yeah, After that. school. I think we will. Don't you wish you could stay home and watch it with us? Sure. Winnie the Pooh. So, we made popcorn to watch a movie. Hot. Did it? It's still popping? Briley just said, well, let me tell you what happened. Yeah, you can sit down. So, this is bag number two. This one got a little burnt. She already had one bag standing here while I was making his. So, I burnt the first bag of Aiden, so I gave it to Briley because she likes it that way. Now, she goes, I'm full. I said, we haven't even started the movie, Briley. Now, you have nothing to eat while we she watch the movie. Like two full bags. I know she has. Not quite. About one and a half. Not even one and a half. I don't know how much was in there. Not a lot. Like, okay. it looked just like that when I poured it in. I've only had, like, I've only picked out the really burnt pieces. That's it. Okay. And that's, like, a, it was literally just Well, if you're full, you're full. It's fine. But we're going to try to find the movie Christopher Robin to watch. Christopher Robin! I haven't that seen bad. it. No, it's I've not. I've never seen it. Aiden didn't want it that burnt, though. I've never seen the movie Christopher Robin. I've never seen the new ones. We're going to see if we can find it. If we can't, we might have to move on to something else. So, everybody in the living room. We just finished Christopher Robin, and what did you guys think? It was good. It was really good. It was really good, and at first, Briley wasn't sure if she wanted to watch it. She's like, I don't know. I kind of want to watch something on YouTube. I'm like, let's just see if it's up here. That was, like, really good. I don't know if you guys have seen it, but not if not, go check it out. Yeah, while we were watching it, me and Mom found out some stuff that I had when I was younger. Because, like, my favorite, yes. my favorite was Winnie the Pooh. I many stuff did. I honestly had probably, like, all the stuffed animals to it. But the one You I did have remember, most of them. You had Piglet. Yes, I had Piglet. I remember I had Tigger. I remember I had, like, this. You had Eeyore for I sure. I had Eeyore for sure. Eeyore was my favorite. And I kept it since I was, like, forever. And then I had a poo. And it sat on a turtle. And mm -hmm. it would, like, ride around. And it would sing. And I loved it. I yeah, it, it came with a rattle. Yeah. And every time you shook the rattle, that's what made it move. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And um, it was like one of like, they were my favorite. And I told my mom, I was like, you know, she has stuff from when she was younger, like toys and like dolls and stuff that they're at her mom's house. And then Kayla has toys and stuff from when she was younger. And I'm pretty sure we're going to save some of Aiden's stuff, but I don't think I have anything of what I was. You like, have. You have some stuff like you have your blankie bear and things yeah. like that, and I'm gonna get like, but I told myself, she's like wanting to go back and try to buy some of her old like toys we can remember. Them yeah, some I'm, of them I you can them up, find. Them there was the little you need to check pool. Goodwills. That's where you go. Mm -hmm. They that probably would have like, some. I want a Winnie the Pooh. Do you? I want to like order just. I just want to sit down one day and just order a bunch of like stuffed animals. And I want to just order them from the ones I had when I was younger and like keep them in a bin and we can take them wherever we move to if we ever move and stuff like that. So when I get older, I can be like, oh yeah, look, these are my toys from when I was younger. Like, True. I loved my stuffed animals. They're like my favorite. And I want to go back you do myself. still have some. Yeah, I do. Your dad has a whole, like a heart. he has a whole bin somewhere outside. Mm -hmm, with all of them there, as long as they, they didn't get ruined or anything, yeah, they shouldn't have. And you got a ton of squishies. Definitely save some of them. Yeah, but I want to just sit down and order some, like, a Care Bear I used to have. Mm -hmm. and, like, all the Winnie the Pooh characters. Do you remember the glow worm? 
you would squeeze it and its face would light up and it would sleep with you at night and it played a lullaby. It's called a glow worm. So, you had a glow worm, Aiden had a glow worm, and I know Kayla had one. So Bradley just found a glow worm and guys, they still sell glow worms. I had no clue they still sold them. Look at this right here, do you remember that? Yes, oh my gosh, we probably still have that. I don't, we might, I don't think I ever what are those? those. We probably do still favorite. have it. Okay, so it's a ladybug. And the ladybug has like that right there, that like pink part of her. It went all the way to her back and her back opened up and you would flip her inside out. And she'd be and a house. And she'd turn into a house. Now they have those, but they're called don't pillow it, pets. Don't it turn from a pillow to, to a, a pet? Pillow. It's like two pets, right? Yeah. yeah. I mean, they're I mean they're cool, but like they're just like not as fun as the one I had. Bradley's reminiscing on old photos. Are you enjoying yourself? I went to use my phone like four times earlier and every time I'm like, where is my phone? In her hand. We are getting ready to have dinner. I had a huge mess on the stove, you guys. This boiled over. I do that all the time. I swear I'm not a bad cook. I just am forgetful and I like thought it was down low enough it wouldn't boil over, but it did. I got a mess. But we're having cheese raviolis, homemade Alfredo, and some salad. Are you hungry? Not really. Me either, but we need to eat it, okay? So it's dinner and games. Yes. Go, Bradley. Are you going first? You want to let Kayla go first? All right, Kayla, you're first. Me and Aiden just played, and who won that round? Me. I did. Are we gonna play again? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Yeah, Intense game. Me and Aiden filled the whole entire thing up the other day and nobody won. Do you remember that? Yeah, nobody wins. The whole thing was filled. We'll come back and let you know who wins. Update, Kayla won. Me and Aiden now. All right, so we're on to movie two, right, Bri? Yep. On to the second one of the night. And because somebody didn't want to be alone tonight while they did their schoolwork, who do we have with us? Kayla. Kayla. Mm -hmm. And Bradley says, how are you supposed to watch the movie with your back turned? That's right, because she's like, because Kayla's like, I can watch the movie and do my school. And I said, how are you supposed to watch the movie with your face facing the other, the opposite way of the TV? I said, do you have eyes in the back of your head? How are you going to do it, Kayla? What? How are you going to watch the movie and do school? We'll figure it out and we'll watch it in my head. No, what did you say you were going to do? She's going to do like that and then look back at the computer. And then back and back, back back, back back. Yeah, we'll make it work, but it's okay. At least me and you are watching it, right? Yeah. Maybe she can join when she's done. I'm not really sure. I know she says she has like a five-page paper to write. And then I think she has something else that she didn't know was due. Because the way she reacted was like, oh, no, are you serious? That's yeah, due is, tomorrow? It's due by 8 o'clock, and I haven't even read anything. I have to write a whole discussion on it. And it has to be in there, and then I have to go comment on someone. Yeah. Tomorrow morning at 8? Yeah. Oh, Still wow. There. So, we were looking at, you want to show them? So I was on Mom's pictures, and I found this picture of me and Kayla at Great Wolf. I still can't believe I was three here. You were. I know. Like, I looked so tiny. I wish it wasn't so bright, and you guys could actually see. Hang on, see. maybe if I turn down my brightness a little bit, it'll work. Mm. Can you guys make them out? And it's hard for us to see. You guys probably can see it, but yeah. is that the only one you had? Um, I actually have more. Hang on. I found a ton of like, oh, there's us in a hotel room. Mm-hmm. That was when we went to a beach trip. Oh, that one showed up good. A beach trip. I, have to, um, I, have to... I think South Carolina. Oh, <laughs> that's me. Oh yeah. my gosh, that was at the beach. <laughs> I remember that. Yeah, but there's just some funny pictures up here. I'll have to, I'll have to find the other one I found. The one of us in front of the movie sign. But yeah, that was yeah. really cool. That was a fun night. So we're calling it a night. If you guys enjoyed our vlog, please leave a like. Don't forget to comment. Also subscribe. And we'll see you in our next vlog. Bye.